Well, hello. Grab a cup of whatever you want to drink. I have everything that you need. I have water. If you want, I have coffee. I have hot chocolate. I have cappuccino. So it's whatever you wish. And if you want um, water, it comes from a well 100 feet down out of the ground. It does get filtered. So figure out what you want. Grab it. Sit down. Let's have a chat. And we'll crochet. Well, I attempt to crochet. I attempt. Oh. Sometimes, sometimes I wonder. Okay. What? We can tell the kids have been here. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. They got me all mixed up. Okay, there's that one. Here's the... Uh, here's... There's that one. Now I have to find out where I'm at. Here we are. All right. Found it. I don't know about your area, but here it is a negative nine. Mm. I guess I should have told you to grab the sand, suntan lotion before you come over. It is cold. I mean, cold. But once we get... Once we get going here... If we get going... <laughs> if we get going... That's a big if. It's like, holy Hannah. All right, come on. All right. Now, we have to find the scissors. If I can't find the scissors, I'll have to use my um, box cutter. We have our scissors. They're just a little fold aways, but they come in so handy. Because they don't take up hardly any room at all. And folding scissors. I've not found a really good pair. So. But they're nice to have. They're cheap. So if you lose them. No big deal. You're out three bucks. Come on. There we go. So, if you lose them, leave them somewhere. It's nothing to cry over. Um, I've lost a lot of small scissors over the years. Okay, so I did that not right. Uh, Really high. Um, I had a little itty bitty pair of the little orange, orangish yellow ones. I think they're Fisk. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right, but it starts with an F. You get them at Joanne's. Uh, but they're like $30. And now, don't get me wrong, they were nice. Um, they were nice shears, scissors, <laughs> but I sure did lose them. So that's why when I travel, I just, I put a couple of pair of them uh, in my bag and away I go. Because if I lose them, No big deal. Okay, so 
That's that. I heard back from Hirschner's. Yes, I heard back from Hirschner's. Um, they were as much of appalled as I was. According, you know, you never really know, but I'm taking them as I'm taking them for their word. Um, they they're reshipping my entire order out to me. They want me to take pictures because they're going to uh, get their money back from FedEx. That's what the email said. And um, because they agree with me, it should as soon as that box split or whatever happened to the box and the yarn got wet, they should have, according to Hershner's, they should have just shipped it back to them, undeliverable, and Hershner's would have re. This is all from the email. So they they just want their pictures, which I've got, and if they want the video, <laughs> they can have the video because you guys uh, watched me open it. It was just. That was just, that was just crazy. Oh, 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 I. <sighs> so. When I was counting how many. Um, hanks of yarn I had left. I have 20 hanks rolled up into little balls. So that way it makes it quicker, easier. And so I was counting two, four, six, eight, and I got to 20, right? And it's like, okay, we got 20 hours together and this project will be almost done. I didn't catch it, but you caught it. <laughs> you sure did. It's like, um, Russ, um, don't you mean ten? <laughs> don't you mean ten hours? And I got thinking. Oh, gee, I guess I did. So we have ten hours in this blanket. Will be finished unless I decide to put a border on it, and I'm not sure if I want to put a border on it. I really don't. I think I just might end it. So, uh, after this video, we'll have nine hours together. But don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. We're going to, uh, once this is done, I will um, go into another project, and we're going to um, get that finished. Because I think <clears throat> there's, a, there's a couple of There's a couple of projects I started last year, and I kind of, <laughs> I kind of want to finish. Um, so, but the one I don't know if I the one I don't know if I can salvage. Y'all, well, for those of you that are new, I started um, a blanket or I started a bag. I'm sorry, I started a bag last year and I want it's a felted bag and it's a good size bag and I want to felt it and I had to put it down well the cat's got a hold of it 
And the yarn that I'm using is, it, you can easily pull it apart. Until you felt it. Once you felt it, you're not going to get that apart. You, you can actually cut it. So if you want to make your own, um, you could knit or crochet up like a big long piece of fabric, wash it, felt it, and you could actually make clothes if you so chose. What, sweet pea? Come here. Come here, big girl. Stop your crying. Well, anyhow. I don't know if the bag is salvageable, so if it's not, we're going to have to do the bag all over again, because I want a bag. If nothing else, Russ wants his own knitted, felted handbag. Just saying. And I've got, oh my gosh, Russ has got so many things. Russ is, Russ is a busy person. So I posted um, all the flowered zipper notion bags. I posted them all. They're on my Etsy shop. Um, they're going like crazy. I just posted them, and I think I've got four left. I mean, not, I didn't just, just post them. I think I posted them yesterday. But nonetheless, if you favorited my shop, my Etsy store, you were notified, or you should have been notified when I started posting. Because I posted them individually. So there was like 10 listings of the little bag or the notions bag. I do have a few left. And <clears throat> I restocked the pens. I restocked my blue and black tote bags that say it's raining yarn with the paw prints. Or cat prints, whatever you, however you want to look at it. Um, I redid those. So I restocked them. So pens are restocked because I was running out of those. You, you know, you guys are so loving. I just love you to death. I, I, I just love you to death. I was, um, so <clears throat> I belong to, um, another organization that helps out military vets or just military people. Um, And so the name of it is um, Combat Crochet, I believe. And it's an org, uh, the group was put together by um, a military person who had to take up crochet because of. Um, mental illness P PTSD I hope I'm saying that right well anyhow and he started it because of that and he also got a bunch of other military people involved who was having same issues as he was and it helped them 
Um, so basically, it saves it saved several lives, a lot of lives, not several. It saved a lot. Um, but anyhow, I belong to that group, and when. In, in my eyes, our military is not taken care of all that well. Uh, for, for what they do, they're not taken care of. So, I was, I get, um, I was contacted through the group by the administrator. And we, um, they, they needed help. So it's like, what can I do to help? Well, it's like, what do you need me to do? <clears throat> well, They needed yarn because yarn keeps their mind active and keeps nasty, dirty thoughts out of their head. And it's like, okay, not a problem. Russ has got you covered. Russ has you covered. When it comes to military, you bet. They're going to they're gonna get my yarn before somebody else begs it. Plain and simple. I, I don't like people. I don't like people to beg. If you, if you need to let somebody know you need yarn, that's that's not begging. That's just you know. Hey, I could have some. You know, I would love some yarn. You know, we all would. Yarn's getting expensive. So anyhow. Um. It's like, what kind of yarn, the whole, and here is a prime example of somebody needing something. When it's like, okay, what is it they want? What color? Blah, blah, blah. And it's like, no, none of that. It's like, what do you have that you can send? Like, whoa. Okay. And the only stipulation, they couldn't have wool. Um, and it's like, okay. You need it, you got it. So, I got a, a 10 pound, a 10 pound box ready to roll. It's already addressed, so when the post office opens up Tuesday, it's going to be in the mail. It's like, that's the difference between a need and a want. If you need something, you're not picky. But anyway, I just... I just did. I just. You, you can tell Russ is getting old and cranky. I am getting old and cranky. Sweet Pea, what is it that you want, honey? What, baby girl? What? Come here. Come here. Come here, baby girl. Oh, up we go. Okay, here's Sweet Pea. Here she is. Here's my baby girl. This is Grandma to most of the kids. And her daughter is... Um... Come on. Oh. oh I... Now you're mad. Now you're mad. Oh, you're mad at Dad. You're mad at Dad, aren't you? 
Come on. Oh, they loves you. Her um, daughter is um, Tippy. But other than that, she's grandma to most. Aren't you, honey? Aren't you, sweetie? Hey, baby girl. Oh, now I have her daughter. Come here. All right, come here, Tippy. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here's Tippy. Yeah, here's your here's your baby girl, Mama. Yeah, here's your baby girl. Don't knock my yarn on the floor. She's like, but Dad, I want the yarn. Oh, pretty babies. Oh, these are so much, so pretty, so pretty. Oh, Dad just loves you. Yeah, you love Daddy, don't you? You're not like your mama. You love Daddy. Oh, we're losing it. All right, go up there with your mama. Go up there with your mama. Or just sit right my way. I, you know, it's your channel. You're the CEO. You do what you want because you can. <laughs> oh, crazy girl. It did not snow near is what they were predicting. And then the lake effect snow, we didn't get near what they were predicting. Now we did get snow, but it turned because there was so much water in the snow. Uh, it turned to ice. I mean, not, not literally ice, but it wasn't fun driving. I'll say that. Oh, my goodness. I am really, really happy about um, personers getting back to me. That makes me feel so much better. And it's, I want to know what to do with this box of wet yarn. I'd like to pitch it. But if they need me to send it back and I don't have it, then I have to pay for it. All of my yarn ain't even in that box. My entire order is not in that box. I am so happy, and it uh, thanks to everybody um, that subscribed. I am really close to two thousand subscribers. That is a milestone. Milestone. So. I don't think I'm going to have, I know it's going to, it's going to be after I hit 2000, <clears throat> but I just don't know how far into it because I want a few people up on panel um, to celebrate my 2000. Um, I want my best buddy, Fiber Spider. I want him up on my panel. I would love Lisa. I would love Cindy. Um,
Buddy is still um, going through some issues. So I can't have my, uh, my friend Buddy. But I do check on him from time to time. There was um, kind of like a podcaster um, called Navy Freak. Used to have a YouTube channel. It's like one day they just like vanished and i don't know why i hope um he's okay it was a guy that was in the navy he had a youtube channel and he was doing really good and it's like i've not seen him in a long time i don't think i saw him at all last year actually it's probably been a couple years but his videos used to be um, still up and available, but I don't think they're available anymore. So I don't know what happened. But I just hope he's okay. I wish no ill on people. I think I, I think I might have to put you guys on pause for a minute. Because it seems like it's a little dark. Does it seem like it's dark to you? Or is it just me? But it seems awfully dark. We're going to have to be tying in the next color. I'm going to finish this color. And then I'm going to put you guys on pause. Before I start the next color. Because it is dark in here. To me anyway. It might not be dark to you, but it is to me. So we're gonna call it quits right there, but I'll be back. I'm not I'm not leaving. You just got here, you just got something to drink. I'll be right back. Okay, so here we go. We have light. Okay, so now I'm gonna do the second color. I'm gonna get this tied in. And I believe the last time when I tied the blue in, I don't think I talked to myself. I think I was talking to you. But one never knows. With Russ, you take your <laughs> With Russ, you're going to take your chances. Okay, now, should have left these open, but it doesn't take long. But look at that. Oh, there's that. And there's that one. And voila. And they just fold up and in they go. Easy. Very, very easy. Mate. 
Anyhow, <laughs> let's see if our knot held. And it did. Now I'm really pulling on uh, the yarn to test the knot. It's not like I'm not pulling hard. I'm really pulling. So it shouldn't come undone. And if it does, well, we'll start winding yarn and we'll start all over again. This is a real pretty purple. Real pretty purple. I am tired and I don't know why. Well, I do know why, but I have not been sleeping well at all. Oh, it's almost like I can't get my mind um, to shut down. Oh, I've been asked by several people about Joanne's Yarnormous yarn set. I did not get in on it. Um, I don't like... I'm not liking the fact that there's people still waiting for their yarn from Black Friday. So that's not a good sign. And some people have tried to get um their money back they're not getting their money back so it's like uh eh, joanne's is starting to get sketchy so the only way i would buy yarn from joanne's right now is to actually just go to the store hey. other other people don't have trouble but i just I just don't, I don't have faith in these yarn companies anymore. I really don't, honestly. It you know, it's taking way too long to get orders. I, under I do understand they get busy. You know, they've got millions, they have millions of orders. You know, they just don't have two. But. You know, if you're going to have, a, if you're going to keep having sales, um, you probably need to put more people in the warehouse to get orders fulfilled. Or re revamp your warehouse so it's easier to get orders done. I just and you know i i get several orders from etsy at one time and it's a lot for me so i can only imagine when you're having tens of thousands of orders all in a day and you're trying to fulfill 
but you know there comes a time where it's like okay i either need to back down or hire people because you without us customers you don't have a business if you keep alienating your customers you won't have a business plain and simple because people's not going to shop Oh, the beef and noodles that I fixed the other day. Oh, my gosh, they were so good. I think that was Saturday night. And there was enough uh, leftovers that we actually were able to have it for Sunday. So we had... Um, Beef and noodles and um, buttermilk biscuits and oof, so good. And I, I am, I love the instant pot. I got, I got two sizes. Now I don't have the um, one with the fancy lid that um, does the browning or the crisping or whatever that is. I don't have that one, but I have the small instant. The small instant pot was the first that come out, and then they come out with a ten quart, and I have that one. And it's like. Now my beef my beef roast was thawed. So all I did was cut it up into cubes, made um, some beef broth, and pressure cooked it for twenty five minutes. Done. And then I just put it on saute and boiled my noodles. And then I shredded up the beef, put in my noodles, and dinner was done. And I just use regular um, egg noodles, medium, not large. I use the medium. They're, the mediums are smaller. They're not as big. But we had plenty. Getting closer for my colonoscopy appointment. Not to have the procedure done, just to go in and talk to the doctor who's doing it.
So, yeah. I am overdue for one. I was supposed to have one done a couple years ago. But now they're saying men should have them done at um, 45, not 50 anymore. Because it used to be 50, but now they backed it down to 45. For some reason, I don't know why. This is a, I'm not a, a purple, purple person. I mean, I do, I do buy purple. I'd buy purple before I bought pink. I'm not a pink person, but. Come on, come on. Oh, I got a sneak. Speaking of harsh nurse, I got a sneak. Well, they sent me an email, and they're like, "Hey, have fifteen percent off plus four ninety five shipping." Ooh. So we might go do a little bit of yarn shopping. Maybe. I don't know yet. We'll have to wait and see. Come on. There we go. I tell you, my mind. One heck of a vacation. Oh, the old saying. Um, oh, how does that go? If you want a trip, I don't I don't remember. If you remember, please tell me. It's a wonder that I even had it's a wonder I was able to tell you I had beef and noodles. My mind is something else. I just love sitting and crocheting with you guys. It's so nice. We can get projects accomplished. We get stuff out in the open off our chest. Very therapeutic.
and we're just about done with the second ball and we still got um 20 minutes to go i might have to grab another ball I might, I might, I might. Oh, someone was asking me about, um, they've not ever been able to find my Etsy. Okay, so, um, on my videos, you're going to see um, a description. And then it's going to say more. You're going to click on that more and it's going to drop down. And it's going to have everything in there. It's going to have my P.O. box, um, my email. It's going to have all of that. I might, have, I might put out a small video and show how to get that, how to get there. But some people don't don't know how to get there. And I want everybody to know how to get there. And now for the new people that are just joining the channel, there is in my earlier videos there is some that I'm sideways. That's my earlier that's my earlier videos. I was just learning. Uh, so yeah. And I've tried to correct it. Um, but I cannot for some reason I can't get it to correct. So I'm just leaving. But it just goes to show that my videos are raw. I do not edit them. Every now and then I have to edit because something happens. But other than that, I don't edit. It takes way too much time. So Russ just behaves himself while he's on camera. And then I don't have to edit. I don't have to edit. If you behave, you don't have to edit. So we're going to pick two more colors. Okay, so we have this green and we have this pink. And this needs wound up. That needs wound up. And this needs wound up. <laughs> so let's see. Green. So we'll get the green tied in and we will continue on our merry way. How about that? Come on. There we go. I'm uh, not sure about that. That's better. That's better. I just didn't like how that knot sat. It was like bunched up or it was weird. So I fixed it. I need to get my um 
ornament out so I can put all these little pieces in it. Okay, now we're going to check the knot. It ain't coming undone, so away we go. Come on, you got to pull it. I have to pull it through both loops. It doesn't work if you don't. Come on. It's crochet time. There we go. So this is this is a really nice green. And that is pretty close to color. That's pretty close to color. I love this new, um, I'm glad I found it on my phone, but it's the pro mode for recording. Things are much clearer. Things are much crisp. I got some corned beef hash out there I can fix. I love corned beef hash. It's just expensive. It is expensive, expensive. Da 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 da. A couple people are waiting to hear Kevin play the piano again. So I guess I'll have to make another video of that. I just have to lock him down and see when he can play the piano. Because he's a busy person. You think I'm busy. He's really busy. I just love this yarn. This is some really nice yarn to work with. I know it's not in everyone's budget.
but I will be having um, another countdown box this year in December. Not Christmas in July. Christmas in July is going to be all acrylic. But my countdown box for December. We're going to have more of those. Um, and we're going to have some different gifts. Some gifts will be the same. Some gifts are going to be different. And there actually might be more gifts. And... This year's countdown box is going to be probably two seventy five. Prices have gone up. Plus, I'm adding to it to make it more functional. Well, I'm not going to quite get this green done. But, such is life. I at least, um, at least you're able to sit and crochet with me, talk with me. Enjoy an hour of crochet. Um, some knit while I crochet, that's fine. I actually need to knit a scarf. I'd like to make a knitted hat again. Oh, so much I want to do, so little time. I was hoping I would have got more done. Than I did. Oh well. We do what we do. We do what we do. I really didn't have anything to show and tell today. Bummer. Oh. Oh, well.
Oh my, okay. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 in a partial. 17 in a partial. So divide that by 2. You're looking at 8 hours and a half. Not bad. Not bad. Well, anyway, I love you. I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope you have a wonderful, marvelous start of your work week if you're going to work. If not, have fun and do whatever you need to do. But Russ loves you. And I'll see you on my next video. Okay? Bye.